Hello everybody, welcome back. We are on level two of lesson 13 on sprite movement. So right at the top it says this level follows a video that you may have watched with your class. So this is one of the two videos that are in your student resources. Uh, if you missed the video, you can watch it in the help and tips tab of this level. So if you click right here, help and tips, uh, there's the video on animating sprites. So you wanna watch that first before you start this level. All right, uh, trust me, it's gonna help. So sprite movement, using the counter pattern, you can write programs that animate sprites smoothly. So you can see over here that they're flying around. Adding to or removing from a sprite's X or Y property in the draw loop makes your sprite move just a bit each time it is redrawn. So do this, read the code that makes the jet go up the screen. So that's right here. Uh, find the counter pattern with the jet's Y property in the draw loop, again, right there. Um, add code that makes the plane move to the right as in the same Im er, as in the sample image, so this right here. Uh, add the counter pattern with the plane's X property in the draw loop. It should look like this. So they're actually showing you exactly what we need to do. All right, so we have variable jet gets uh, create sprite, set the animation to jet, variable plane gets create sprite, plane set animation to plane, function draw, the background's gonna be sky blue. So let's just run and look. Background sky blue. The jet is moving, and you, you, so it's moving up, but it says minus three. And that's because if you guys remember, this is zero, zero up here. This is 400 down here, 400, 400, zero, zero. So if you want something to move up the screen, you have to actually subtract a number, all right? So um, we're going to do the same thing over here with plain X, so Sprite X. All right, except I'm gonna put it in the right spot. All right, so plain X gets plain X plus three. All right. So that, uh, go away debug console. So that looks exactly like that, but let's see if it works. We're gonna reset, we're gonna turn the grid off and we're gonna run. There we go. Oh, almost collision. All right, so we got that done. Level two is done. I will see you guys on level three. Here we go.